Who needs friends when you got the internet? Whoa. That's your classic IBM 5100. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 anime hackers. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we'll be looking at characters that are computer experts with a love for gathering and analyzing data. These are usually social outcasts that are more useful behind a monitor than on the front lines. Number 10, Akira. Valve Rave, the Liberator. School life can be difficult for anyone, but it can be especially brutal for someone who's prone to extreme anxiety attacks like Akira. Her timid nature confines her to a makeshift fort in the corner of a classroom with nothing but stuffed animals and a computer to keep her company. Of course, in typical hacker fashion, this self-seclusion allows her to hone her skills with technology by keeping an eye on the students via security cameras in the school. She also utilizes the multinational network called Wired to circumvent government censorship and stream Haruto's first battle to the public, effectively making him out as a hero of the people. Number 9, Hanzo. The devil is a part-timer. It's time for the hunt. Today I rise above Satan himself. We bet you wouldn't expect someone as powerful as Lucifer to actually be a lazy purple-haired computer expert. Hanzo is the Demon King's general who shows off his power level immediately by destroying part of the city. Whoa. I did that? In an ironic twist, it turns out he actually prefers to browse the internet, play games, and do anything but clean the apartment. We're home. Good, I'm starving! His skill with technology matches his prowess in battle, mastering the ways of the keyboard in no time flat. He even puts it to good use by prank calling Amelia at work and sending the team on a mission to reclaim a game console. I'm working right now and you know it! What do you think you're doing?! Number 8, Yusaku. Yu-Gi-Oh! Vrains. It's a rare thing to get a main character that's also an antisocial hacker. While his hairstyle might suggest otherwise, Yusaku is a high school student that prefers to blend into the crowd and go unnoticed. Though he might seem lazy and cold, his aversion to attention is due to his secret life as a hacker who fights against the evil group known as the Knights of Hanoi. <laughs> Burdened with a troubled past, Yusaku takes on the identity of Playmaker, a charisma duelist that battles the knights in the cyberspace known as Link Vrains. Using an AI he stole in order to tip the odds in his favor, he engages in high-risk speed duels to take revenge on those who've wronged him. Number 7, Sugumi, Guilty Crown. Boasting some impressive strategic skills, this cute operator is the main support for the Funeral Parlor, a guerrilla group that dedicates itself to liberating the country from a corrupt government. All right, you better take care of my baby, Zaya. You got it. From inside her hologram cyberspace, she's able to analyze enemy movements and hack systems with ease, all while playing a few games on the side. Don't overexert yourself, Aya. Your poor craft can barely take anymore. She also possesses a useful void, a special power encoded in a person's DNA called Hacker's Interface that allows her to make an exact duplicate of anything, even herself, and control it remotely, making her an all-around ideal support unit that any resistance would be happy to have. This is my voice! Replicating hand scanner! Number 6, Izzy. Digimon Digital Monsters. Now if ever you get transported to a digital world out of the blue, having a computer expert on your side will definitely be helpful. This storm's making a mess of my infrared internet connection. Izzy is one of the Digi Destined, a group of kids called upon to protect the digital world from all sorts of nasty threats. Like all hackers, Izzy has the need to know anything and everything about the situation he's in, and he works together with his partner Tentamon to piece together the circumstances. Don't you ever feel sort of left out? Not at all! So you would rather spend your time with puzzles than with people. His love for gathering information ties directly into his power as he is bestowed with the crest of knowledge, the physical form of a Digidestin's best attribute, and just the thing he needs to digivolve his partner into the most powerful form. Mega Kabuterimon! Yeah! Number 5, Ishikawa. Ghost in the Shell, Standalone Complex. In a world where everything, even brains, are enhanced or outright replaced by technology, 
a hacker is the worst thing you can deal with. Luckily, Section 9 has Ishikawa to help them combat these unseen threats as the team's expert on technological warfare. It's all yours. Here we go. He supports the team during missions by diving into the web and gathering as much information as possible to tilt the odds in their favor while also hacking a few mainframes along the way. We don't know if he's as augmented as the Major, considering how he easily gets captured, but as a support specialist, he's second to none. Don't screw with us, punk. Section 9 practically invented dirty tricks in information warfare. Number 4, Daru. Stein's Gate. Every mad scientist needs two things, a cute assistant and a down-to-earth sidekick. Daru certainly isn't cute, but he makes up for it as the hacker of the lab. Next up, I give you Hashida Itaru, our hack member 003. Uh, it's hacker. The way you say it makes no sense. Designated lab member 003, he's responsible for bringing to life all the future gadgets that Okabe comes up with. While most of them might not seem very impressive, he is partially responsible for perfecting the D-mail system. Could you give me that spiel again? Only instead of gross, could you say wet? Alrighty, the bananas get all wet and fluffy. He's not just a script kitty either, as he is able to hack into Sin's database by himself in an attempt to dig up some information on just what they were doing. He may be a perverted otaku, but he's certainly damn lovable. Don't be embarrassed? You're the prettiest boy these goofballs have ever seen. Balls are not, man. I would so hit that. Number 3, Yuki Nagato. The melancholy of Haruhi Suzumiya. The SOS Brigade is filled with eccentric characters. An esper, a time traveler, a god. She doesn't really care as long as she's got a place to read. But the most mysterious is the quiet Yuki Nagato, whom you wouldn't expect to be an artificial human created by an alien. I have been created by the data integration thought entity that supervises this galaxy. As a result, she's bestowed with a slew of superhuman powers that would make even the strongest anime characters green with envy. However, it's her ability to analyze and manipulate information that makes her arguably the most useful character in the group. I changed the elemental boost information. Elemental what? Homing mode. In one instance, she modifies a bat so that it can only hit home runs, and in another, she hacks a game and reveals that the other team is cheating. But we'd recruit her to our club any day of the week. I repeat, I am not disobeying your orders. I would like to modify the program in a manner that is consistent with the current levels of Earth technology, ensuring equal playing conditions. Number 2, Inamuta. Kill la kill. He's a member of the Student Council, a small group of elites that answer directly to the Student Council President Satsuki. Apparently they were personal spats. That's why we never received reports. He's also responsible for analyzing life fibers and developing new Goku uniforms so that every new enemy that Ryuko faces is stronger than the last. Analysis complete. As you might expect, Inamuta is not as powerful in battle as his comrades, and he relies entirely on his skills as a hacker, boosted by his slick keyboard uniform, to analyze his enemies on the fly. This allows him to anticipate attacks from any angle and counter immediately, making him a nerd you definitely don't want to mess with. There's nowhere to run! Start giving me some interesting data or I'm going to be very disappointed! Number 1, Radical Edward, Cowboy Bebop. Have you got a rogue AI shooting lasers at Earth from space? Radical Edward will help you out whether you want her to or not. Bebop, here, here! While a lot of the characters on this list are anti-social or shut-ins, or both, Edward is the complete opposite with a unique personality that can put a smile on anyone's face. When it comes to technology, this hyperactive hacker is nothing short of a prodigy, navigating her way through the complicated web of cyberspace to gain access to anything from police aircrafts to satellites circling the Earth, all in real time and with frightening speed. Bebop looking for hacker bounty head who caused land carvings. Alright! Thankfully, her soft heart means her skills will never be used for evil. Am I done now? Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.